Ladies and gentlemen, you are now standing at the center of time and space. Ooh. <laughs> now you get the idea of this. Let's get real, shall we? What exactly is this line? Well, this line, zero degrees longitude, ladies and gentlemen, is in fact nothing. Anyway, you've come all this way. <laughs> but it's a very important bit of nothing. Because you see, what it actually is, is an imaginary line that runs from the North Pole across the surface of the Earth and onto the South Pole. And in fact, there are 360 of these imaginary lines all around the world, all numbered differently. What do they do? Well, they help us to measure how big the world is. But also, and far more importantly, they help us to calculate exactly where we are upon the Earth's surface. Far more often than not, knowing where you are on the Earth's surface is far more important than knowing where you're going. Yeah. Yes, especially if you are out at sea. That's what these lines were all about, sea navigation. But prior to these lines of longitude being established, and then as being able to measure them, millions upon millions upon millions of shipwrecks happened. Millions upon millions upon millions of people lost their lives, and far more importantly to the governments of the day. Millions upon millions upon millions upon millions upon millions! I'm not exaggerating. Pounds worth of cargo finished up at the bottom of oceans because the captain couldn't be told its coordinate of longitude. So, what happened to change things? And why are the buildings here? 